Uh, obviously disappointed in the result. You know, I thought we played better than last week in Chicago, but uh, but the result was the same. Um, you know, just uh, when we get chances or we get or they make a mistake or we get a break on the offensive end, we can't put it away. Uh, you know, we make a mistake in the back and they bury it. You know, and then it's game over. So, uh, you know, we got to find our way out of this funk, and uh, obviously today we didn't. Matt. Uh, it was, you know, it was hard to play on. I mean, you really couldn't couldn't necessarily run with the ball. So, one of the things we talked about at halftime was trying to play with less touches, play two and three touch, you know, and and keep the ball moving. Uh, you know, you saw a lot of players slipping and sliding, uh, but you know, it was the same for both teams. Don, uh, certainly seeing you jiggle the lineup a little bit. Could you kind of talk about uh, what you hoped would happen and, and what you actually saw? Uh, you know, obviously we wanted to get Freeberg in there. I thought Freeberg played well until he, he ran out of gas. Um, you know, I, I thought Andy Rose wanted him to play more as a midfielder. I thought he did that job well, so I thought we did a better job of controlling the middle of the field uh, this week. Um, you know, uh, you know, Roldan, we pushed up to the right wing because uh, I, I don't think Barrett's played well, uh, so we decided to go that way. Um, you know, but uh, but Nagel had opportunities today, and he didn't put those away. But uh, so we tried to mix it up a little bit. We wanted to get Leo out there. He'd been training well and doing a good job at practice. I know he's very familiar with Sanchez, uh, and he's comfortable playing against him. So you know, I mean, I, I don't think any of those changes you know hurt us. Uh, I think all those guys, uh, all those guys did all right. But right now, we're not doing enough to score goals. Well, do you feel like Eric kind of gave you what what you wanted to see? Yeah, until, like I said, until he ran out of gas. I mean, he's a little more, he plays the ball a little bit quicker. He's a little more direct, you know, and he gets, he connects a little forward more, uh, you know, gets in front of Ozzy a, a little bit more. So we're not quite as deep with those two midfielders. Jackson, you talked about the two to three touches there in the second half going in. Was it the plan to put in Papa and Barrett and Pineda in the second half, or was that the plan going into the match? Well, we knew Pineda was going to go in because we knew Freeberg wasn't going to make 90 minutes. Uh, you know, we wanted to see how the other guys were doing. We thought Thomas was uh, sort of slowing down, so we felt it was a good opportunity to bring on Papa. Uh, although I wanted him to play higher uh, on the left, and he ended up dropping deeper in midfield. So that helped us control the ball in midfield. But, you know, we're not going to score goals there. We need to score goals nearer to their goal. And, uh, you know, and, you know, Barrett is, uh, you know, we held, you always try and hold the last sub a little bit in case somebody gets hurt. We weren't sure. Ozzy took a knee in the, in the rear at one point, so we didn't know if that was a hamstring or what till we got a chance to talk to him. Jackie. How did you feel uh, Papa did his return to the club? Uh, thought he did all right. He helped us keep possession in midfield. Uh, but I, I need him to be more goal dangerous. He's got to be more goal dangerous with our team. I thought Roldan did well. I mean, he had a couple of opportunities, a little more savvy, a little more experienced. He might have taken those a little better. Uh, but uh, I thought he did a good job of, of getting, you know, behind, hitting some crosses, uh, taking people on at the right times. You know, I thought he did a good job. Well, uh, what, what did you see on the goal? Uh, was, it, was it miscommunication or just a long ball? That ball that got in between the two center backs, bounced up, looked like Marshall headed it. Uh, him and Doyle sort of headed it together. The ball fell forward for Doyle. We were a little late closing in. Uh, you know, you, you want to feel that they could have gotten there quicker to, sh you know, bump him and shepherd him wider uh, onto the field. And uh, obviously that didn't get done, and he finished it well. Jack? Coach, do you feel like you weren't able to get a true look at the changes you made just given that the ball was playing so differently on the surface? No, I think we got a good look at the changes we made, yeah. I mean, I, I think Troy's done well. I mean, I, I mean, obviously the goal, you know, the goal was scored. But I mean, outside of that, there was not a lot of difficult things he had to do. Uh, you know, he came up with, uh, I think, one save to his right early on. Uh, you know, but I thought for the most part, you know, uh, not a lot of stuff. You know, he he wasn't tested a whole lot tonight. Done. Um, it seems like you've almost you've given pretty much everybody a chance. That's true. Uh, <laughs> What uh, what can you do going forward until uh, your other guys are back? 
I just, we, you know, we got somebody's got to find it, you know, along the way. I mean, we're going to keep, we're going to keep working. We're not going to stop working. We're, you know, we're going to keep thinking about it. We're going to keep experimenting. We're going to keep trying to, we tried to do a lot of, you know, crossing and finishing, build up the confidence of the guys up front. Uh, we tried to do that, you know, we'll continue to try and put out what we think is, is a formation that can help us, you know, attack. We felt last week in Chicago, we didn't control the midfield enough. So we set it as an objective. We wanted to do a better job of controlling that, figured if we control that more, we get more chances. So for the most part, I thought we did that. Uh, but now it's a matter of finishing the chances. So, I mean, this is the group right now uh, that we have. And, and um, obviously it was disappointing that Craven got injured. Uh, because he would have been he would have been starting tonight. It would have been good to see him and his energy out there and his work rate. Uh, so you know we'll just have to have to keep working. Hope that uh, you know uh, between you know the coaching staff and the team that uh, that we come up with a solution. Sometimes sometimes when you're in something like this, it just takes you know something to bounce your way. You know, sometimes you just need a fluky goal. You need something to bounce your way, go in, and then it's like all of a sudden the dam breaks. Uh, you know, it's not like we're getting outplayed. It's not like we're getting, uh, uh, you know, annihilated in games. Uh, we're in every game, but, you know, because we haven't been able to score, the pressure mounts on the defense, and so it makes it, you know, then becomes a little more psychological than it becomes physical. And, uh, you know, so for us right now, it's it's just, you know, we need – Something to bounce our way. We need something maybe fluky to happen, but uh, you know we need to take advantage of it when it does, and hopefully that'll uh, put us onto a different course. With results elsewhere, you guys fell from first to maybe even fifth, depending on how the Portland Vancouver game goes. Is there a point where that becomes a cause for concern? The way that the standings are shaking out here. Standings are tight. You know that's just the way the West is. You know right now I'm not I'm not going to be overly concerned looking at that. You know. Um, I'm just concerned because, you know, we gave away points at home and you don't want to give away points at home. Uh, can you give us an update on I mean, Martin's uh, recovery? Uh, worked out again today before the game. You know, it's getting better. Uh, we think he's going to be able to uh, come into some team training next week uh, and participate uh, in, in more team training than he did last week. Last week it was very limited. Uh, so, you know. Hopefully within the next week or two weeks.